The unknown soldier's been training here now for six to nine months. He's stepping into the ring with one of the best wrestlers. I would say within the top 20 in the country. Now, if not the, the whole country, but if not the world today. Smart. Smart. Get in the head of the champ. Good job, kid. Carlson knows he's got it. I'll quick him. Thing with uh, Jose is he, he he really he goes into each match with a plan. He never takes cal he takes uncalculated risks, but his big risks are usually very calculated. This is a man who's very prepared. The thing that separates him from other people who prepare is that he can prepare quick. you see, he knows that he's outweighed by 25 to 30 pounds. Ooh, and he's throwing him kicks. He's planting that in the subconscious of the soldier, but the soldier is not intimidated. Look at this. Acosta's in trouble, and look at it. The American soldier steps up and blocks out the mind games. The mind game the chess, if you will, of Jose Acosta. He's got that hammer lock on Jose. Jose fight from underneath. Couple of low place tricep slash elbow into the solar plex. Irish whip. Big tackle by the beefcake. They should call him the American beefcake. Sunset flip. One, two, and wow. He's keeping up with the champ. What a pace. Jose is so good with those legs. He's good with the feet, the knees, the thighs. Thinking man's wrestlers, always thinking out there. Not a lot of wasted movement. Keeps himself in great cardio shape. In these matches, you can go and check the length of his matches every year. Archives and a cover, one. And you can see the length that he goes to. There was one time a couple months back where Brandon Campbell faced Jose Acosta in a 60-minute King of the Iron Man title match. Unbelievable endurance by Jose Acosta. Keeps himself in terrific shape. And look at Jose. And look, he had scissors in now. He knows that he can't compete upper body-wise, but if he keeps his legs on the head of the soldier, he stands a better chance for a nice arm drag slash judo throw by the soldier. Did somebody say USA? <clears throat> Jose, handful of tights. Gets the soldier back into the ropes. Mm, goes to work on the midsection. Shoulder to the solar plexus. Right in the press plate. Gives him something to think about. Crosses him in. Goes behind on the slam. And look at this victory roll. Nope, down to a schoolboy. He gets a two count on the champ. Big body slam. One arm. And now what? Elbow drop and Acosta is it compromised. One and a half, 1.75 I'm gonna say. But I'll be damned if the soldiers are really out here upstaging the current heavyweight champion. He's coming along. Makes me proud to have my thumbprint on him for pro wrestling training. Don't forget a revenue streams, folks. Premier Pro Wrestling on Pro Wrestling Tees. Premier Pro Wrestling on Patreon. Premier Pro Wrestling on Red Bubble. We can get that shirt. I stand with CM Punk. Premier Pro on Red Bubble. 
Like and subscribe here on YouTube while you're here. Appreciate the support on YouTube. We've got tremendous support on YouTube. And look at that. I feel like it's not all for naught. This is something that I try to teach these guys is to not give up out there on the little things. And I'll be damned if the soldier is taking heat. And there goes Acosta. Oh, he almost went through the wall here. <clears throat> Hard way. Damn, he flew to the middle of the ring. One, two. Oh, wow, that hard way seems to have broken Acosta in half. Five minutes gone in the match. Five minutes expired. Head to the midsection. Second one caught the solar plex, as you can see in the breathing. Oh, look at that. Spear out of nowhere. Cover. One, two. Oh, do you know how close that was? Do you know what this would have done? For the career of the unknown soldier at this point? Wow. Impressive showing tonight by the soldier. Our students are really coming along. Look at Jake Hazard from earlier. Look at the unknown soldier in the current. How smart is this kid going right back to that arm? Got all the pressure on the left shoulder of Acosta, who's putting his fingers into the mass. Didn't work. Oh, oh, here comes the hacksaw, Jim Duggan. No, Acosta like a snake. Look at this. He That's what I'm talking about when I say that this guy comes prepared for every match. Wow. Oh. Just as I'm over here thinking to myself, how smart is Acosta? I told you he's a thinking man's wrestler. The unknown soldier kicks out at two and change. One, two. He kicks out at two and change. He's playing a shitload of heart, man. And that again in itself, that's where it starts, that long-term in-ring condition. How much can you tape? and keep moving forward. How much can you take and kick out before the referee hits three? Now Jose is on the left shoulder and clavicle of the unknown soldier. And up and also the referee, Acosta pulled him down by the hair to keep him compromised. Ian Anderson referee did not see it and that's how good Acosta is. Soldier getting up to his feet. Soldier firing in the stomach. That's three. And he's out of that harm's way for now. But look at Acosta. Block that with his shin bone. Now, you can check me on this. Facts are facts. The hardest bone in the body, other than the front of the skull, is the shin bone. Not many people can block a forearm, a palm strike, a punch with their shin bone, and a cover by Acosta. Soldier, unbelievable. Open him up, and now he's back to that shoulder slash clavicle. Yeah, he's working it over, man. If you can take away that appendage or disable it, disable it, Gonna make his job easier at the end of the day, and he's just uh, relentless on it right now. He's got him inverted, and that way, Acosta can rear back with all of his weight on the hold. Referee doing a good job this time. Look at his hold! One, two! No, it would have been a cool way to finish this match. But look at, he's not done yet. One, two, way to stay alive, kid. This is that endurance that I'm talking about, my God. He caught him right in the side of the head, possibly the jaw. And the soldier got turned inside out. He's way too close to the ropes for that, but it breaks away the psyche of the soldier. And now he knows how close he is to the ropes. He's going to take advantage of the situation and punish the soldier right into a body scissor. Again, very smart. He can't match power with the soldier with his upper body, but he sure can with those legs. 
And look at the strength of the soldier. Those have got to be 20 inch arms. And there, one, two, nicely done. Shortest point. The easier, softer way, and he got a two count out of it. Right now, though, he's getting that oxygen compromise, too. The soldier is taking it. One, two. Sometimes you get respect just from showing that you can take it and keep coming, and that's what he's doing. Ten minutes have expired in the match. Ten minutes gone. Now he's got him all wrapped up. He's got the body scissor and a sleeper. The soldier is trying to tap the crowd for an energy source. They're meeting him halfway. Let's see if he can parlay that into staying alive. And look at that. He is staying alive, if even for a little bit. And here come those mighty triceps again, this time into Jose's floating ribs. The soldier slow to get up, but up. Oh, and he went for the elbow. You got to take risks. Oh, but Acosta, for the inverted shiny wizard, nobody was home. Acosta with the cover, and he's hooking ropes this time. The referee caught him. The referee caught him. And look at this is what he does. He set him up for this right here. Shin bone to the throat. Shin bone to the Adam's apple. Shin bone to the windpipe. One, two. Nope. The man keeps coming. I'm talking about the American soldier. Now, again, this is pounding on the clavicle, both clavicles and the neck. The only upside here is that at least with those arms spread open, the lungs are open. If you can keep yourself from panicking from the pain, it's a good time to get oxygen in. Let's see if the soldier learned that. But that's the thing, is how do you not panic? He hits the ropes. Oh, right under the chin on that one. He got all the foot. Across the slow to cover. One, two, no! The soldier just keeps kicking out. He obviously, he had a big lunch. He knew that going into this one, facing El Guerrero, Jose Acosta, you better have a big lunch and get 10 hours of sleep the night before, man, because you're in for a war. Oh, man, so gifted. So much power behind his kicks. Jeez, man, he just drops that big 240-pounder like a child. Oh, and that shin bone to the side of the head again. That might do it. One, two, no! Oh, and that time he kicked out. That was all heart, that was all balls. Kong sized balls, that's what it takes in the rest of the industry. Look at a soldier fighting back. Series of strikes. He's got El Guerrero reeling. I heard that last shot. It made contact to the skull of Acosta, who put the foot up and caught him off guard. And what's he gonna do now, man? Oh, that shin! And the soldier rolls toward the rope, forcing Acosta to roll him back over. He lost a precious second there. Acosta looks like a desperate man right now, and he's hanging on to that head like a bull rider does the reins for that eight second count. Now look at Jose Acosta. Look at him use the ropes, unbeknownst to the referee. I mean, this is his shit. This is his kink, and this might be it. The arm dropped twice. Oh, thank God. Ian Anderson, the referee, caught him. He might be out. Let's see. One, two. No! Kicked out with authority, despite all the odds against him. And Jose Acosta going back to that left clavicle and shoulder. Oh, there he goes, driving that shin bone in. You can see, hear, and feel the pain in the arm of uh, the American, the unknown soldier. These people are doing him right now because they're mad. They know he's just being plain mean. Soldier's got a lot of friends out there and a lot of friends in the locker room. Decent guy. Look at this guy still on his feet. Oh, oh, there's a salute. That clothesline.
and turn the cost inside out. There's a salute. He saluted him. Oh, oh, up to seven. The soldier's up. The count is broken. Here we go. Do it to him, baby. Nice elbow. Oh, oh, beautiful hammer. And now he's got to use that size advantage, that strength advantage. That. Oh, right into the knee. One, two, three. Your winner at 14 minutes and 58 seconds, El Guerrero Jose Acosta.